Anders light tank was developed by the Bummer Group of Poland. Development started in 2008. The Anders has an unmanned turret, armed with a fully stabilized Swiss Ruag CTG 120mm smoothbore gun. This gun is completed with an autoloader. Autoloader is located in the turret bustle. This light tank fires standard NATO 120mm ammunition. Some sources claim that only 22 rounds are carried by this light tank. 12 rounds are stored in the turret bustle and remaining 10 rounds in the hull. Secondary armament consists of coaxial 7.62mm machine gun. There is also a 12.7mm machine gun, or alternatively a 40mm automatic grenade launcher, in a remotely controlled weapon station. The Anders has an all-welded hull and turret. All occupants are seated in the hull, which gives additional protection for the crew. This Polish light tank has a modular armor. Basic armor of the Anders provides protection against 7.62mm rounds. It can be rapidly fitted with add-on armor modules. With add-on armor it provides protection from 25mm projectiles. This light tank can also withstand 8kg anti-tank mine blast. Furthermore the Anders is fitted with an integrated active protection system. This light tank is equipped with NBC protection and automatic fire suppression systems. It also has a laser warning receiver. This light tank has a crew of three, including commander, gunner and driver. Furthermore it can carry four additional infantrymen, if required. These additional troops enter and leave the vehicle via the rear ramp. Anders is powered by a German MTU turbocharged diesel engine, developing 720 horsepower. The same engine is used on the Austrian Ulan IFE. Engine is located at the front. A dozer blade or mine clearing rollers can be fitted at the front of the hull. This new Polish light tank is not amphibious, however it can be fitted with a deep wading kit. After preparation it can ford water obstacles up to 5 meters deep. The Anders can be airlifted by the new Airbus A400M military cargo aircraft. This light tank was designed as a member of the whole family of tracked armored vehicles. Proposed variants include an IFE, engineering vehicle, armored ambulance, command post vehicle, ATGW carrier, SPOG, radar carrier, armored recovery vehicle. All of these variants can be mounted on a unified chassis of the Anders light tank. It is worth mentioning that a prototype Anders IFE version has already been developed. There is a version of the Anders fitted with a 105mm CTCV turret. It has an automatic ammunition loading system and modern fire control system. This version is also capable of firing Falaric 105 gun launched anti-tank guided missiles. These missiles are launched in the same manner as ordinary munitions and have a range of 5 km against ground targets and helicopters. Thank you for watching our video, hopefully it will add to your insight about tanks.